hello guys welcome back to the channel today we're gonna be learning on how to scan our document using notability for ipad users and iphone users as well so here's the trick this is my guys don't laugh if you don't understand here all mark is still i want to be something so there were different this was the lesson that i was taking when i was in tome when i was learning the turkish language so Hang model going to library, you know, want to go there, Kotipane, Git make it still wants to go to the library. But this video isn't about bragging about these stuff, no. This video is gonna just cover to scan. So we can try to scan this or this one. So to do that, first thing you need to open your notability like this. If you don't want to create any new note, any new note, you can just come here and click this import icon over here. When you click that, it gives you option to import files, Dropbox, Google Drive, we got OneDrive box, WebDAV, and we got document scan. So you can click document scan and it will bring you into this side. You have the option for color here. You can change to be to be gray, color, gray scale, black and white. Or you want to be a photo you can choose yourself so for me I'll keep black and white or gray scale let's keep black and white sorry guys I'm having a bit of room and also we have the option here to either to be auto or manual that means manual you do it by yourself so auto shutter let's try with the auto and show you first so our document like here let me try guys to to bring the camera at a good position so you try like that you can just keep it on top like this you just bring it up like that then it will capture itself when it so for auto is a bit harder you need to level it for it to to happen why is it not taking guys you can just put it by this side maybe from the top when you see it is aligned the hole you just tap let me show you back this way. the quick and easier tip which you can do we can just put it like this maybe after at the top let's try to refix our page like this it, when we just try we can keep it out like that or we can keep it manual it becomes easier so manual you just look your your page if now is underlined like that the whole stuff then you can capture by hitting the the capture button here that's it so after capturing like that we can see we can just drag to adjust the size of the edge and to this side you can just drag up to the end then you have the option here either to keep scan or to retake so you click keep scan and there it goes so you can choose to save you choose save maybe and you have the format should you import it into pdf or image if you keep it into image that will be in j jep jpn or stuff like that but you can keep it into pdf and it will start generating the pdf so now we can see our document is scanned over here so what i had written is what is happening so let's try and on the scan again to see how can it come when it is on on an image format so we hold it back you can see you, you just hold it at the top it can align itself So it captures automatically this is automatic ready for scan then you can choose save 
we choose let's this save as the image image generating so if we you see when it is saved as image when it's saved as image it becomes so narrow like on the page the scan as a pdf it cover the entire screen but now as an image it is just this part you see very tiny so you need to make sure when to choose to save as an image you see but still the same stuff i don't know if you can yeah still the same stuff the same so you need to be careful to choose when to use uh, but when to use the pdf generating or when to use the image yeah, so we can see from here now how it looks this is our pdf the entire has been occupied the entire page different from the one which we just scanned a couple of minutes ago which was an image so that's it and for others if you are in a side where we are taking notes let's say maybe you are to this page taking notes and you wanted to scan a document to add it here as a picture so you can just click the three icon here and you choose document scan which is different from that side where we had just the 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 part to import then you had document scan down at the bottom you choose that and it will bring you to the same position here you can just hold your phone like this and there you are go so you position like just that maybe let me just take some parts great eh? destroyed our so we can see now it's captured let's see the difference save save as image so we can see our image has been saved here let me delete this a bit yeah so like that so that was all about today guys sorry if i took much of your time and sorry for the shaking of the camera i couldn't have to do it in any other way i love you guys see you in a question drop on the comment section if you're new here and you're watching me now as your first time don't forget to subscribe i love you guys bye